So now we're going to get our brushes together. And basically what you want to get are some small brushes for details, uh, some medium sized brushes for coverage, but also control, and then some larger brushes for coverage. Basically, if you're going to start painting like an entire background, you want to start with your larger brushes. Um, try to think about what you're doing and what's going to make the most sense to do. Also, you're never going to be able to get great detail with uh, brushes like this. So, um, another thing you want to look out for is uh, when you're picking out a brush, sort of go like this and, and pull at the brush because some of the synthetic brushes, um, the hairs actually fall out fairly easily or some of the cheaper brushes too. And um, what happens is when you're painting, the pieces of the brush will fall out and they'll end up in your paint and on your jacket. And um, luckily you will hopefully be able to see them and pull them out. But if not, if they dry on there, and then you've got, you know, like, or hair is stuck in your design and that's never good. So you really kind of want to don't skimp on your brushes. Um, try to get something that's quality and um, that's really got nice hair and that's fine and that you're going to be able to have a lot of control with.